Come on, ref. That's a free man. Like, how is that not a free? If he scores out of this, I swear to God. Look at him. All he's doing is shoulder charging, man. That's what these guys do when they can't get the ball, man. Just trying to, trying to upset me. What's the crack, lads? We're back. Back-to-back -back episodes when I'm recording these. We are into Division 2. It's our first time in Division 2 uh, since we started the latest uh, run. So we've got a couple of days left, obviously, until the season draws to a close with this one, with the phase. But we are into Division 2. This is our first match in Division 2. We need, what, eight wins? Well, seven wins and a draw, or else six wins and a couple of draws. Um, but yeah, hopefully we can get a game fairly early doors and get in, get a match going. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys at kickoff. All right, let's win to a match straight up. We are going to be playing in the San Siro. Uh, yeah, I'm happy enough with the white kits, and let's see what this guy is rocking with his team. Messi's fully up, lads, Neymar's up. Uh, Puyol is up as well, although we will start Van Dijk. Ronaldinho's up, Goretzka has been really, really poor for me lately, lads. I'm gonna actually try Vieira in there, you know that? I haven't really given Vieira a chance this, this, uh, this season, these last couple of games. But let's see what this guy is rocking. Um, we have our defense on, we have everything good. Benzema, Ronaldinho, Mbappe, all 100. This is going to be tough, man. This is going to be tough. He's got a very, very, very solid team. 99 Donna, 99 Rodri. Oh, no, man. That was a heavy touch. Yeah, making the runs. Oh, no. I don't like this touch, man. I don't like this responsiveness already. The double touch. All right, no complaints, though. All right, Neymar. Touch, bad pass. Alright, I'm reading this guy though. I'm reading him well. If I can just get my AI to react a little bit quicker, it'd be nice. Alright, he's gonna play wings maybe as well if he's playing one touch. No, I'd say he'll play a lot of central. A lot of central. So it's all about getting back and helping out into them areas and then turning him over. Man, you see the way my players are taking a heavy touch? I don't like that. Mario. He's on a man marking mission with Kunde back at Mario. Let's see how that works out for him. Oh, Messi, beautiful. Beautiful Messi with the double touch. That's what he does, lads. Very, very strange play style. Nah, you're not getting past me. You're not getting past me, boy. No! Oh man, he got super, super lucky there. He got super lucky there. He's getting the luck. Oh man, he's getting the little lucky breaks. Cover Maldini. Well, oh Maldini, boy. Shield. Lovely Makalele. Possession football at its finest, lads. Oh, if I score this. If I score this! Oh, what a goal, baby! Boom! Man, when eFootball plays like this, it's enjoyable, man. It's super enjoyable. We're back there. We're back there. What will do, lads? Get up, Romario. Oh, what will do? We get a bit lucky. I'm not going to say we didn't. Boom! What a goal, Romario. He's the best in the business, lads. He is the best in the business. That's a half chance. That's a half chance. But if Romario sniffs it, lads, and all the people saying it doesn't matter how you train up your players, it does matter, man. It does matter. Oh, he still did it. Messi, lads. Messi is just naughty. He is absolute filth. It's a great ball. Lads, Romario is just so good in those areas. I love it. If that was a manual slide, that's some save, lads. What defending? Carlos again. Oh, he butchered me, ref. Come on. 
Come on, ref. That's a free man. Like, how is that not a free? If he scores out of this, I swear to God. Look at him. All he's doing is shoulder charging, man. That's what these guys do when they can't get the ball, man. Just trying to trying to upset me. Keep it clean, man. Keep it clean. That's some win, lads. That's one of my best wins. I just completely took away what he wanted to do. See this guy's team. All right, this guy is playing meta, meta, man. Uh, we're going to have to try and close him down as best as we possibly can. Carlos is up for it, though. Oh, man, the connection feels bad already. Hopefully it's the same for him. It does feel really, really bad. And why does this always happen, man, when I need it? <sighs> this is going to be a long game, man. This is going to be a long game for me. Because I can already feel the connection. Hopefully it settles, but it's not looking good. Block. Ah. Get up now. We need to. We need to win. Man, what the? F what did Makaleli do there? Get up now. We need to. We need to win. What? Oh, that was... come on, do a quick Neymar. Oh, it was a stupid pass. Oh, I should have read that. Good finish. Great finish. Very good finish, composed. It's my own fault. Take nothing away from that finish, lads. With the connection. The ki <laughs> hey, Bart, with his back. The connection just feels off for me, man. The player switching is killing me. Ugh. Yeah, this could be bad. This could be bad, lads. I knew it was going to be a long game, but the connection was a bit funny, but we'll play on. We're not going to make excuses yet. Yeah, I mean the connection. I, I know myself. The connection is off. Like there's just there's just nothing I can do about it. Unfortunately. Yeah. Good, good finish. There's nothing I can do about the connection, man. I've never quit of the game and I don't want to quit because I still think I can get a goal back and, and rock this guy a little bit but it's just unplayable for me man it's super super weird I, I literally can't move my players alright let's we're into another match uh, this guy's playing a 4-3-3 I'm pissed off now to be honest with you so I'm not even going to bother I'm just going to go straight in and take it out on this guy it's just, it's just super frustrating, man. It just, it's the one thing holding me back. When the game is playing brilliant, I think the game is a really, really, really solid entry. I think that the online is grand in terms of most games. But when you get a game like that, where the control is taken out of your hands, it's just, to me, it's not worth playing. Like, genuinely, I'm not going to sit there anymore 
and lose six, seven nil to guys that I would not lose to. I get, like when. Uh, and if this game is the same, man, I'll quit this. I don't care. I'm not going sitting down playing a game that I don't enjoy. It's as simple as that. I, I value my time too much. I'm not going to waste my time bitching and moaning to you guys about it. I don't expect to win every game. I've done multiple videos on this. It's not about winning or losing for me. It's about literally that when the connection is bad, what people don't understand is that everything is affected. It's not just your responsiveness. It's not your input. It's also got to do with the auto, like you can't auto cancel, you can't manual cancel, you can't have players running in the position that they're meant to be running in. Everything, like, it's just, it's like a different game. I'm not saying that it's impossible for me to have won that last game. Get in the net. Get in the f Oh, get in the net. And in that game, maybe the connection's bad for him, man. Who knows? Who knows? It wasn't bad for me. It was better there, but... Oh, man, I don't know. That game is after sending me on a trip. It's just so frustrating, man, that you can sit down and play seven, eight, nine matches in a row where the connection... Like, you have little blips of lag here and there. But then you come up against a match where there's literally, there is, you might as well just quit, man. There's no point. Like, I'm not going to sit there and bitch and moan for 90 minutes solid. Like, I value my time too much. I value your actual time too much of sitting there and, you know, me just being like a little bitch, talking about everything and giving out about everything. It's just, it's just, it's just not, it's not worth it. But anyway, we get to 50 match with decent uh, stats. Obviously, when you look at him compared to Goretzka, it's going to be a different, completely different thing. Obviously, his ball control is passing everything. Um, defensively, it's going to be no contest and aggression and all that. But I do like him as a creative player. So, yeah, I definitely do recommend him. I will do a full review on him maybe as well.